Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Taurus. This is going to be your daily reading for your general energies and also for your love energies, Taurus. Let's see what's coming up for your general energies, guys, before we move on to your love energies, okay? Let's see what's coming up for your general energies, Taurus. What is coming up for your general energies? the two of wands the prince of cups king of cups and the prince of swords so these cards definitely represent a very watery energy because they have the king of cups the prince of cups two of wands and okay a little bit stable energy but a lot of emotions and also a little bit unstable energy okay so kind of like there's a balance between stable and unstable energy but there's no balance in emotions okay you feel really too emotional no matter what the situation is you might like even though like everything is just little okay you you might be a little emotional but then it's just like as though everything is going weird and wrong and you just burst out in tears okay even though the situation is just a little bit emotional you tend to exaggerate it and make it as though like everything is gone and you have to cry to come out of that energy okay you'll just feel that way because you are very emotional today or you will be emotional today that's what i see here guys you will be very emotional today it's not just like you're a little bit emotional you're very emotional and whatever you do you're just like too emotional you burst out crying and you don't even know what what you're doing at the moment okay but it will definitely happen and you're really sick and sad because of this energy okay Again, Taurus, you're just going to go towards your dreams, go towards your goals. You're no longer a very open person because we have the Cancer card here. So, Cancer is what they do is like they hide in their shell. Like if they see something coming in their way, they tend to hide themselves or they tend to not be open. And you also are in that energy, Taurus. That's what I see here. You definitely are not open to people you definitely are not open to circumstances you tend to hide behind things like you tend to hide behind your insecurities you're not able to face life whatever it is however it is okay so that's the whole energy that i see for you here guys so again that same energy that i'm getting here but you're just going to be more distant because you felt like when you were like very close to people they tend to they took you for granted or something so you're coming out of that energy okay let's see what's coming up for your love energies guys let's see what's coming up for your love energies One more. Hi, guys. So, what I'm getting for you here is that for your love energies, we have the Ten of Swords, the definite like hurting energy. So this is not like ordinary relationship for some of you. Okay, for most of you, it's not just an ordinary connection. 
when I mean when I say it's not ordinary it doesn't mean like it's a connection that it was not meant to happen or something like that when I mean it's not ordinary it's definitely this connection has a more meaning than a normal relationship okay so there are people so many people in your life who just come into your life and don't teach you anything don't like Im- make you improve yourself and just go that's just a waste of time okay it's just like maybe they learned something from you but then you never learned anything from them and those kind of relationships are kind of like waste of time waste of your time definitely but i don't see that here okay it's just like this person came into your life to teach you something they came into your life to make it a better one for you okay they really didn't come into your life all of a sudden and they really changed you if you think about the situation much you will understand which way this person changed you but i definitely see here this person is not that simple connection that you usually have okay it's just a for some of you it can even be twin flame or soulmate but mostly it's a karmic connection but karmic connection also is not just an ordinary connection okay people who have karmic connections think like it's just karmic and it's nothing you have to care about this connection it's not like that you learn a lot of things from a karmic connection than you do in a soulmate connection even okay so that's what i see here for you guys okay so this is all i have for you guys your lucky color for today is orange and your lucky crystal for today is quartz can use like rose quartz or clear quartz okay so bye guys i see you all tomorrow